Our top story, the case against a local chiropractor found guilty of sex crimes against patients comes to a close. Dr. Michael Pollack appeared in Richmond Circuit Court this morning, then went straight to city jail. But as Melissa Hippolyt reports, he didn't stay there long. She joins us now live with an update to her problem solvers investigation. Melissa? Well, Cheryl, former chiropractor Michael Pollack was brought here to the Richmond City Jail this morning to be processed. But like you said, he will not be here for very long. He has actually already served all of the 15 days of his sentence outlined in his plea agreement. So he will be released after booking. Now that plea, an Alford plea, which means Pollock did not admit guilt on sexual battery charges, but he did say there was enough evidence to convict him. Now as part of the plea, Pollock will be required to register as a sex offender and he can never practice as a chiropractor again. When the judge asked him if he had anything to say, he said, no, ma'am. One of his victims was in court today. She said she wanted to hear an apology and an admission of guilt, but she never got either of those. She said she is frustrated and she does not feel like the sentence is fair. Working for you in Richmond, I'm Melissa Hippolyte for CBS 6.